Hey Awesome Doodle fans, Sugar Babies are four weeks old today and today's video, normally we introduce them to a real food on their four week video. Uh, we soften up their food um, and give them real food for the first time. But these guys, they're just, they're just too small still. They're, I, I know that they're not going to be super interested in it. Um, so I'm not going to do the mash video today. Um, but the good news is that you guys will get a bonus video sometime between now and when they're five weeks old. Um, giving them the mash. I'll wait just a few more days and then I'll give them the mash. <clears throat> Romo. Romo is um, finding his voice today. So uh, here's what's been going on uh, over the last week. Um, everybody just got curly all of a sudden. Uh, look at the curls. Um, it's so funny when they first start to get curly they get these things where their hair just like sticks out here and there and um, he's getting curly, uh, she's getting curly um, Romo's curls are coming out here around his neck um, everybody's starting to um, get curly and by the time they're six weeks old they're just going to be little fluff balls um, so I'm real happy um, with the way that their coats are progressing um, these little guys they're they're real dainty still. They're um, you know they're they're still babies and you know they're wandering around the puppy box and they're learning to uh, find their voice and everything. But they're still real dainty and um, you know these these guys are going to be you know under twenty pounds. When we have a litter that's you know where they're thirty five to forty pounds, those puppies. Um, at this age, those puppies are ready for mesh. You know, they're a little bit stronger, they're a little bit more confident. Um, the, the, smaller, the smaller size litters um, tend to be a few days behind, you know, litters where, you know, those puppies are bigger. Um, doesn't mean their development is slower or anything. It just means that it takes them a little bit longer to, um, you know, mature and get to that point. Uh, so there was some some chaos in the puppy box this morning. I don't know um, if everyone saw it. I know at least a couple of you uh, puppy stalkers uh, saw it. I won't mention any names, but you know who you are. Uh, so Sadie basically was trying to poop and she couldn't poop and then she came over to the puppy bed and she kind of pooped her pants while she was in the puppy bed and it got on um, somebody's face and I was downtown at an appointment um, so I had to come back and save the day. In addition to that, um, somebody went over the edge. So <laughs> while I was downtown I had to call Susan. Susan came over and, and got that puppy back in. That was my fault. Um, I hadn't taken out the rails yet. And when that rail is in here, it gives them a little step. Whoa! It gives them a little step to um, get on and get over. So I've taken out that rail. Um, this will that'll keep them contained for um, you know a few more days, and then uh, after that, we're gonna go to the big playpen. So for the five week video, um, I'm hopeful to show you them in their new playpen. Uh, we'll just have to see you know if they're ready for the playpen. If they're not quite ready for the playpen at five weeks, then I'll, um, I'll put the door in here. So I've put the litter box in here, and uh, these puppies are really not ready for the litter box. Um, that being said, I still want to put the litter box in here because <coughs> I want to get them comfortable in it. Um, I've already seen a few puppies um, get in there and uh, walk around. It's real funny when they when they got in there because they were just not quite sure about it because it's kind of unstable underneath their feet. But anyway, over the next few days, they're going to get more comfortable uh, walking around in the litter box. And before you know it, you'll see your little one um, using the bathroom in there. They tend to always uh, start pooping in their first 
Um, when puppies pee, you know, even when they're eight weeks old, they really don't think about uh, where they're going. Um, but when they poop, they think about it a little bit more. They've got longer to, you know, they kind of feel it coming on. And just like little kids. And, uh, you know, it gives them time to get into uh, the litter box. So you guys will see that um, over the next week on the puppy cam. Everybody's doing great. Um, everybody's healthy. Everybody is super, super cute. I mean, these, these puppies are just so stinking adorable. And they um, are making eye contact with me. And uh, very, very aware of me when I get in the puppy box. And uh, if you've seen me in here, you know that they want to be on top of me. Uh, little Romo here, he's still the biggest one of the bunch. Um, everybody's doing great. Um, what else can I tell you? I mean, they're, they're doing awesome. The heating pad is turned off now. Um, it's still nice and warm in this room, but not, you know, overly warm like it was when they were first born. Um, everybody's doing great. And uh, on your five-week video, uh, you're going to see the new playpen, hopefully, if they're ready for it. And like I said, sometime between now and next week, um, we will make a special video of them uh, eating their mash. Over now.